Hello friends. Welcome back to All in Law. Today I'm going to talk about the very important topic that's stress incontinence. Okay guys. So before starting a discussion on this, I would request you to subscribe to our channel that's All in Law. Okay guys. Let's talk about this stress incontinence. Stress urinary incontinence okay guys so let's see what are the things we should look for for USM examination the definition of this stress incontinence is involuntary leakage of the urine with exertion remember this is really very important for USMLE so what are the things you should look for in if you want to diagnose this as a stress incontinence look for is there any precipitating fact like exertion okay exertion okay or sneezing because these things will what you call increase the abdominal pressure when there is a more abdominal pressure that will what you call push the bladder I'm going to show you something like that for example if this is a bladder okay this is a bladder oh my god this is a bladder okay and this is sphincter over here here when he coughs okay or when she sneezes or when she what do you call does some exercise or any any kind of uh, any kind of what do you call um, uh, reaction that increases the intra abdominal pressure and that will cause what do you call uh, uh, urine to come out and that will lead to stress incontinence okay guys so name itself indicates there should be a stress and that's known as stress incontinence okay guys so stress there should be a stress there should be any stress for that in your SML examination try to look for in examination what you need to do is you try to look for is there any stress like exertion sneezing coughing or laughing or any kind of increased intra abdominal pressure increased intra abdominal pressure okay guys so what what's the mechanism how does it occur as I said you before that's because of increase intra abdominal pressure okay because if there's any pressure what do you call if this is a bladder and there is a pressure and this pressure will co co what do you call contract the bladder and this if this urine in the urinary bladder and this will try to look for a way out and that will come out what do you call come out of the pressure of uh, what do you call the force of a sphincter okay and it will cause continence that is known as stress incontinence okay guys so now in USML examination try to look for the age of the patient here this is really very important okay in this you see is a multi parous woman multi parous woman very important okay or is there any pelvic surgery she has underwent before pelvic surgery okay very important so what are the things you should look for a stress incontinence in a patient with uh, sorry in a patient with a stress incontinence in your assembly whether she is a multi parous look for very important second important point is look for any increased intra abdominal pressure okay that's very important okay and try to look for age of the patient sometimes they give directly age rather than multi parous okay so what's the treatment plan for this okay what's the treatment plan how would you treat that simple the first thing is try to remember that's the most important things you have to tell is weight loss try to tell the patient to lose the weight the other type of exercises or pessaries can be used like kegel exercise okay kegel exercise 
then pessaries pessaries non pessaries okay then we have some surgical procedures sling procedures sling procedures okay so these are the things as a treatment plan for usml examination try to remember the weight loss is the best next step if everything is okay okay this is the first case then it should be the treatment should be the weight loss is the first what is the step in the management okay guys so i hope this is very useful for you for your usml examination if this is if this video is awesome please do like us and please do share our videos with your friends and thank you so much for watching this video take care see you soon in the next amazing awesome video with us on all or none law take care